So at this point, me, we were just struggling to keep to get things out. It just turned into me doing a review, and then whoever we could possibly convince doing a review to do one, and then me doing another one. Because at, all the other gamers were just not cooperative at all at this point, and me and the editor just were fooling ourselves into thinking we could continue doing the best gamers at this point. Like we should have realized it, it was basically over. Which was the much anticipated sequel to Mass Effect. So Mass Effect 3, I didn't play it. I have I never played any game in the Mass Effect series, so start off, I'm sorry for reviewing this game without, you know, having played it. I don't think any of us played Mass Effect 3, but you have to understand, at the time, we were just in this position where we wanted to get stuff out and to do this best gamers thing, but we couldn't because we weren't, the rest of the gamers just weren't cooperating or being reasonable, and... Now the first yeah, thing you sorry, 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 sorry. Is that Shepard uses the catalyst to destroy the I'm not sorry for spoiling the ending, though. It was a pretty bad ending, you know, you shouldn't care. Whatever. I don't know any of these words. What are these words I'm saying? I don't know anything about Mass Effect. No, wait, no, that's the last thing you were supposed to... Okay, I'm sorry, can we start over? Now, being made by Bioware, Here's one thing I never understood, like, uh, this game's an RPG, RPGs. right? That's what people Mass say. But all the trailers always just look like a third-person action that game, that like, this is an RPG? How? After you finish the single player, I don't get it. Go online with your friends to see who can get the most headshots against scrubs. Uh, you know, this specific I review, I didn't like it at all when I was finished. I was just not satisfied. Like Once our editor put his hands on it and did his thing, I, I warmed up to it a bit. It makes me feel good. But looking back on it now, like, I, 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 I still don't like it. This is my least favorite review I've ever done, probably that any of us have ever done. I hate this review. And if you watch them for too long... So this cutscene right here, in the original cut of the review, I was talking throughout the whole thing basically struggling to find something to say and to fill that air. Great Fortunately, work. our editor and cut listen, that, and I'm glad for that, because I have this tendency hey, to just go on and on and on and not realize it until it's hey, too late. Hey, you. You're under arrest. This cutscene, though, was terrible. I hope this isn't representative of the rest of the cutscenes in the game, because look at this. There's no emotion in their faces. There's no emotion in their voices. And this, is, this looks like a pretty, you know, serious situation going on here. I love that El Cabong noise. So what the hell? This is a triple A title, you know, multi millions of dollars spent on this. What the hell happened to this cutscene? Yeah, Conrad. This is embarrassing. How could they have made this and watched it and not th thought? Wait a second. This isn't good. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Wait a second. I can't stress enough how great the animation It's ridiculous the, the tricks developers have to do to make the 360 I mean, play these modern games. Like, we're pushing this generation of hardware has been going on for too long. I seriously hope the next Xbox and PS3 have some serious hardware, because this is just ridiculous. The whole tally thing was a big deal amongst people on the internet, so... You know, she was a stock image, so here we go. Oh, look at this, we got a picture of the Park Domain girl. Look at her, wow-wee. Ooh. Ooh, ah, the ah. Gamers. One of our favorite things about games is DLC. So DLC, yeah, it became a running joke with the best gamers. Oh, we love DLC, blah, 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 blah. I don't need to tell you that most DLC is pretty terrible since it ends up just being a thing about making money instead of giving you extra content. I had no idea Mass Effect 2 had this much DLC. Look at that. Shit. Why would anyone buy all that shit? Unbelievable. Not only that... It even has DLC for Street Fighter This game ta Tekken, came out around the time when we were making the review, so we just threw that in there. My favorite thing about this on disc DLC This joke right here goes on for way, right way too long, and I, 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 I shouldn't have let it go on this long, I should have cut it. But he just, he just I'm surprised like our editor didn't cut it. Me. The, the, but it's here, and yeah. I was trying to make this this high chip making guys sound like the you know the voice actor talking through a fan like how he sounds in the actual game. I couldn't get the thing going. I couldn't get the voice effect going in Audacity though. So instead we have this bad sounding low pitched Jamaican guy. I tried. Jennifer Hooper did an amazing The whole hamburger helper joke is overdone, so I I mixed the name up a different way. Oh, it's Jennifer Hooper. Stupid joke, whatever. God, Rockhawk64, you're an idiot. What's going on right now? 
This gay sex scene originally went on a bit longer, and well, why are they touching their fingers? I went gradually from put together to kind of crying, but in this no, cut version, the editor cut it a bit. I suddenly go from being, you know, fine to crying right this. here, so it's a little more awkward of a well, shift. I liked it better in the original, the but I might have been going on for too long in the original cut, so... touching their digits again! Oh, they're gonna go play Halo. Mass Effect 3 is the best story ever yeah, Every grandpa story should be full of sex and violence and guns and, Yeah, good thinking Mass Effect people Who made this game Bioware? Whatever the multiplayer before, but let's actually do it now. Okay, so obviously this didn't happen to me and this error screen here is photoshopped But this is a legit thing that did happen to people. There was reports of this happening everywhere People, like this is legit And getting banned from single player? For right, fucking yeah, around in multiplayer, that's just unacceptable. Player. Regardless, that is not acceptable. You can't do that to people. How can I be banned from single player too? Ridiculous. I, oh, wait, things that developers what? and publishers well, get away with is just okay, wait, completely wait. unbelievable nowadays. All right, according to, according to my sources in the back. So yeah, wrap things up. Um, join a hacked server on multiplayer. Sorry for reviewing this game without having played it. Like I said at the time, internally, just things were a fucking mess, and, and um, we were just trying to review, guys. do something, I... but we fucked up. So sorry. I got banned from Mass Effect. I'm not allowed in space anymore. Oh my god. Uh, and at this point, by the way, like the numbers at the end of the reviews, they don't even mean anything. Like obviously, Mass Effect Three doesn't deserve a one and a half. It deserves a much higher score. Not as high as the big review sites are giving it, but higher than one and a half. I can't tell you what number it deserves though, because I still haven't played it. <laughs> oh god. One more commentary left. Let's hope that, you know, Loud House comes out soon. We're working on it. Trust me. Trust me. It's coming soon. For real. I love you.